For this week's video, I have edited my friend's photo and I'm going to show you how you can edit yours too. Welcome back to the channel and I'm back with yet another episode of editing my friend's photo. Since none of you seem interested in sending your images for editing. Anyway, this time I have edited this image ko edit kiya, jo ke humne recently our meetup. Pe li thi. It was just a random click but its pose was good and seemed perfect for the fantasy style edit. If you also want to edit your or your friend's image, edit karna, then you will need to find or click similar pose. Or if you don't you can use any decent kind of images, of course in some kind of a pose. This image is not going to No. Step 1 is to select the decent images which we can use for our edit. Step 2 is finding an idea or concept for the image. I often seek inspiration from the other artists work on platforms like Instagram or Pinterest or jo mujhe achhe lagte hain unko main save kar leta hu drawing inspiration for similar edits. So look out for the other artists work. Step 3 is creating the composition according to your idea. Nailing these first 3 steps simplifies the rest of the edit. Then we have to edit the image to edit the image to edit the image to blend the image to blend the image to blend the image to blend But getting the basic rights make the following steps easier. Therefore, compose according to your idea. Step 4 is to adjusting the brightness values of the objects according to the scene. I have used this technique abhi and this is a game changer. Essentially, it involves adjusting objects brightness value based on their placement. The objects pass hote hain, wo dark and the dur hote hain, wo bright or faded. Honge. To do that, you can use tools like level adjustment or similar ones that deals with the brightness value. Personally, I level shoes. Sometimes breaking rules is necessary. In this case, even though the planets and skies are further away, they should be darker to achieve a night look. Step 5 is color grading. You can choose different kind of color tone according to your idea. For this piece, a night blue tone was obvious. Color grading ke liye tum kai tarah ke adjustments layer use kar sakte ho according to your taste. I maintain the same color tone throughout using hue and saturation adjustments.
Step 6 involves adding special effects. My main subject floated so I added magic spell signs on the woods. By the way, you can get the magic spell font for free from the link in the description along with the stock images. और मेरे मेन सब्जेक्ट के लिए मैंने कुछ मैजिक ट्रेल्स भी ऐड की उसके आजू बाजू सो दैट इट लुक्स लाइक दैट ही गॉट सम पावर्स एंड ही इज यूजिंग इट and also light up the eyes, you know, the magic stuff. Or fir kuch fireflies add ki foreground mein aur thodi aur galaxy images for our sky. At this stage, I fine tune details that seem off before moving to the next editing step. Or tum log chaho to isse sathwa step begin sakte. Step 8 Painting Highlights and Shadows This step is vital for enhancing artwork using levels, exposure and at times UN saturation adjustment layers I added highlights and shadows as per the light direction Tumko jitna time chahiye utna time le sakte ho isme bas ise achche se karna because this really enhance your artwork
and I also added grass seal hoods in the foreground. Step 9 Final Touch Ups To enhance the floating effect around my friend, I added floating grasses around him. I completed other tasks like adding particles, applying camera raw filters, color lookup tables and finally using the filter gallery I gave the glowing edge effects to the whole artwork. I hope you enjoyed and learned something new and I'll catch you in my next video. Till then stay wild and here is the final piece. Thank <laughs> you.